Hello, today I have a collective haul video for you slash new items in my wardrobe. It's a bit of a random one because it's a mix of designer, a mix of high street, a mix of charity shop, a bit of a mix up, but then I am a bit mixed up. This is just my style. I like what I like. So yes, I know you're supposed to pick your niche and stick with it, but this is my thing. I like kind of a bit of everything. So I've pulled it together and I'm gonna show you but I've also kept something in the box. Oh yes, I am that person that likes to unbox things ceremoniously, like, ah, oh, like this, and it's down there. It's been in there for the weekend, and I've been dying to get them out then. Oh, oh, what's that then? So yes, I've saved it. I'm gonna unbox it in this video, but let's start with some high street stuff. So some of this stuff you may have seen already in some vlogs, some of it I haven't worn, so again, that's a bit of a mix up too. But let's start with something I haven't worn. And that's this skirt here from River Island. A denim skirt, it has a zip halfway down. What I really like about this is the detail. It's just a bit unusual. You see at the top there, it's got two poppers with pointy bits, pointy bits, look, <laughs> like that. So you just popper it down. And then it's got this kind of hanging, buckle thing it's not a belt it's just it's pointless it's pointless but it looks nice so I just thought that's a bit different you know it's a denim skirt with a bit of extra so I thought with a t-shirt or a shirt maybe cowboy this situation up I really like it showed Ian this he was like oh what is that what is that but I'm liking it I like all this kind of unusual bits and bobs going on what do you think I haven't worn it yet I need to have a play around and style it up in my wardrobe but yeah, so far I am liking it. And this one was £35. Next from River Island, I have worn this. <sighs> da -da -da, you might have seen it in a couple of my vlogs. It's the crazy two-piece. Yes, there's a trouser here as well, but I'll show you this shirt. It has really nice kind of ruched detail on the sleeve and a bow. Um, let's try and make it look attractive. Hang on. I'm gonna have to put a picture in of me wearing it, but I just love the print. It's red, blue, and a cream. It's very Gucci, do you think? I think it is. And then the matching trousers as well. Again, I have to show you this picture because I'm just like, hey, look at these trousers. But again, it's like a full on print. Really, really like the intense print. This is actually in a petite range. So I'm five foot three. It fits really nicely on the leg. They may do it in a standard length as well, I'm not too sure, but this was in a petite range. I'll put all the details down below of prices and things. Next from Primark, again, I've worn this, so you may have seen it. Is this cream, cream, white, off-white cream shirt with the chain print on it. This is kind of everywhere. I think it's something that's in at the minute. Oh, so fashionable. But... This print is kind of everywhere for spring. This is from Primark. They have lots of this kind of print in. So if you like it, go and head there and have a look. But I just really like the brown, the brown and the gold. Looks nice with jeans. It's one of these chuck on, don't have the iron tops. I like it. Again, I'll put the details on the screen or down below of prices. Next up is this t-shirt from Hush Homeware. I don't normally buy stuff from Hush, but I saw it, I was like, that's nice, but I'll tell you what really happened. I took back that neon candle for £30. I thought, I've got £30 now. Saw this top for £35 and thought, well, that, that's only a fiver then, really, isn't it? Do you like my logic there? So this T-shirt was £5. It's £35, but it's nice, and it's green. I thought it looked nice with jeans and, I don't know, maybe even a blazer. But I thought, this is lucky on it. Got to tell the universe, right? Got to put it out there. I've got it on my top, like I am lucky. You know, a bit of luck might come my way. <laughs> but yes, I do like it. It's very nice, but the label's on still. So I'm like, is it, is it, is it a keeper? Hey, you know, fiver. Next up is a scrunched pair of jeans that I've just grabbed out of the wash. Try and make it look presentable. These are from New Look and yeah, the Halley Disco jeans. Yes, Halley Disco jeans. I have another pair of these as well. They're high-waisted-ish. I've got a pair on now, so I'm trying to feel it. Yeah, so it's definitely an over-the-roll rather than under-the-roll trouser. 
which is comfortable. But I really like the, the ripped knee, makes me feel like I'm fashionable and funky. And then at the end, it's also a raw hem. Yes, the good staple is the grey. I'm trying to get away from the black, I've moved on to grey. So yes, these are from New Look, put the details somewhere again. Right, on to Tesco, bit of a random one, a cosy. Random, I'm not even going on holiday, well, I hope I am. I haven't booked one, so maybe, maybe now I might be going somewhere, Ian. I have a cosy. I just saw it, I don't know why, I don't know what made me try it on, but I did, and it was like the stars have aligned, I need to buy it now. If you if you get a cosy, you try it on and it looks nice, buy it, don't even think, don't think, just get it. And that happened with this. There's ruching here. I like a ruche on a tummy area because it's like, that's not a roll, that's a ruche, yeah? It fits lovely. There's cup support. I like the neckline of this. And I really like the metally bits. Bit of rose gold, copper thing, bit of detail. But yeah, it just it fits really nice. It feels like good quality. I'm happy with it. So bring on the swimming. Oh yeah. This was 20 pounds. Next from Tesco is this zebra print coat. I'm gonna have to put in a picture of me wearing it because Yes, again, I'm holding it up like this. But look at the print. Look at that zebra. I've moved on from leopard. I've gone on to zebra. This is £35, kind of an oversized fit. It's kind of a bit big on the shoulder, a little bit big in general, but I kind of like that vibe. Yeah, I just, I tried it on and again, it was like, yes, I have a cosy and a coat. You know, it was a bit like mixed up. I told you it was a mixed up kind of vibe. So I'll put in that picture so you can have a look. I've just realised I've only actually got one charity shop thing. I thought I had something else. But that's these <laughs> little clip-on earrings. There we go. It's like little pearls. And I thought, instead of getting my ear pierced again and letting it close up again, I can just, you know, attach these on and pretend that I've got another hole. Let's do it. Let's do it. Ah, oh, there. Can't really see. The sun's a bit bright. Amazing, doesn't it? Yeah, 50p. 50p in the charity shop. Amazing. And then these, may as well show you, these were from Next for £2. I thought I'm going to wear these with my cosy, be all like, you know, in summer. Yeah, they're my little, little earrings. On to the unboxing. So I said that I kept it boxed and was going to open it on camera and I, I've kept that box and haven't touched it. But there's something else and I kind of already worn it. And that's the scarf. This scarf is absolutely gorgeous. The reason I got this is because it matches this, but let's open this out. So I got this from Bista Village. The prices and stuff are put down below if you're interested. It's definitely worth a little visit there if you're after this kind of thing. Get yourself a bit of a discount. But I just love the colour of this. It's kind of like a two-tone. So it's got the darker pink and the lighter pink on each side. So it's not like reversible as such. It's, yeah, it's just two stripes of colour. And it's got the Gucci print on it. And it's just a lovely, soft, baby pink, sort of. How would you describe this pink? I don't know. It's absolutely gorgeous. I love it. Look. Amazing. I got this because of these. Let's get opening. Right, ready? 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 Not one dust bag, but two. Fancy. One for each shoe. Yes, they're shoes. Ta da! Pink loafers. Let's get them out. I've been wanting a pair of Gucci loafers for like ever, forever. And I saw this colour, it's just gorgeous. It has a weird square toe. I wouldn't normally go for that, but when it's on, it looks really, really nice. I love the colour, obviously love the horse bit detail. I really like the tongue on it, strangely enough. <laughs> I like, I like the, the tongue. It's just a really nice shape, beautiful colour. Put them on and it was like, we are meant to be together with the scarf. 
So absolutely gorgeous pair of shoes. Again, from Vista Village, a nice bit of a discount. So if you're, again, after some Gucci loafers, it's definitely worth having a look. Look at them. And the bottom's even leather. I don't want to wear them. I don't. Should I just put them on my shelf? Yeah, so nice. I'm going to have to spray these and keep them away from the kids. But, yeah, absolutely love them. This is like my birthday slash Mother's Day slash kind of anything kind of present. You know, I've attached whatever to it. I don't care. I'm having them. So that and that and that. Ta-da. I'm going to have to put my leg up by my neck and be like, oh, they match. Delightful. I think you're going to be seeing this combination a lot. So that's it for this collective haul. Let me know what you think of this because, like I said, I've pulled everything together. But are you more of a, nope, I like designer, nope, I like charity shop, nope, I street, I street's where it's at. Or do you like to see things pulled together? I obviously like to pull different things from different places and kind of make it my own. That's just what I do. So if you like that, let me know. Give me a bit of feedback. That would be great. And I'll see you in my next vid. Bye.